Okay. Okay, this is the, the Bicon implant, and it is not a screwed in implant. It is, has these plateaus which provide greater surface area for uh, the integration of the implant. And the surgical protocol is with a, a pilot drill, and this just goes at a thousand RPMs with external irrigation. When you start with the latch reamers, the drilling is at a very low speed of 50 RPMs without irrigation. And as you're drilling, you're collecting the bone from the flutes of the reamer, and you're saving that bone to pack on top of the implant. You then would wait three to four months approximately for the osseo integration, and then you expose the implants and you choose the appropriate abutment and the abutment is just simply tapped in. There are no screws. It is a frictional fit. And after that, you just may take a simple impression and cement your crown. I cannot understand how you bring the implants in, in the bone. Okay. As I said before, the implant is not a screw. It's just a press fit implant. And once you've prepared your osteotomy to the appropriate diameter, this implant is a five millimeter, you would then press the implant into the bone. There's no screwing action necessary. Only by hand? Only by, by hand. Or there are some instruments where you can ensure that the implant is seated to the bottom of the osteotomy. You can put this tool in and just simply give it a gentle tap and make sure the implant is in the bottom of the osteotomy. And you're waiting three months? Three months, yeah. Exactly. Okay. And where's, who is the distributor in Germany? Uh, we have our own operation here. It's uh, located near Frankfurt, outside Frankfurt, and it's uh, Bicon Europe.